are back at the NBC Sports Studio at Levi Stadium with our first Sun Power Electric game. The Christian Brothers Easter Classic filled with some of the best teams in the section out of the 12 teams to play in the tourney. Rio Americano and Del Campo are the two teams left standing. The Raiders enter the championship game with an 11 and 3 record. The Cougars come in at 8 and 5. Our Nick Pecorero was there at Del Campo for our Sun Power Electric game. Game. Nick Pecorero here at Del Campo High School for the championship game of the Christian Brothers Easter Tournament. What started with 12 teams over three different venues has boiled down to the final two. It's Rio Americano and Del Campo in our Sun Power Electric game. Del Campo pitching has allowed just one run over the first three games of this tournament. Oregon State commit Jake McEwen takes his turn on the bump in the final for the Cougars. Matt Moses hit a walk-off grand slam in the second game of pool play. Rio, meanwhile, has been equally impressive on the mound this spring break. Only two runs have crossed the plate against Raider pitching. Caden Beloyan and Brady Wilson anchor the lineup, while Chase Christensen takes the mound for the 11-3 Raiders. Hey, this could also be a preview of what could be the deciding series in the Capital Athletic League later this month. Top one, McEwen, pitches around a leadoff walk, and he's looking good early, but so is his counterpart, Chase Christensen. He strikes out two in a 1-2-3 bottom half. Bottom two now, Rio's up 1-0, but Dallin Harry takes advantage of a wicked hop. And that ties the ball game at one, and the next batter is sophomore Jaden Franklin. A tough play for the shortstop. Good effort, but the run comes in and Del Campo takes the lead. Next batter is Matt Moses, another sharp grounder up the middle. Rio can't come up with that one, and the Cougars lead 3-1 after two. Top three, bases packed. Mac Hossman with a comebacker. The pitcher overthrows the play at home. Wilson scores, and it's 3-3. Same inning, bases still loaded. Christensen with a little dribbler. That squeaks past the defense, and Rio goes up 5-3. Christensen follows with a shutdown inning. Two more strikeouts to add to his five on Tuesday. And top five, some defense for you now. Lance Moses in left field. How much do the Cougars like Lance? A lot, especially after that play. But Rio wasn't done hitting in the fifth. Christensen goes back to left field with runners on. That'll score one, and the Raiders lead 6-3. Top six now, Raiders batting again. Mack Hossman had a nice day at the plate. Three RBIs and two coming off of this double. And in the same inning, Sammy Marr hits it really far. So far that this cameraman can't even keep up with it. That's his first of the year. And Rio Americano goes 4-0 and oh and takes the Christian Brothers Easter Classic. Could this be a sign of things to come from the Raiders? Yeah, we were kind of on a, a rough start too, and we kind of had like some problems go on. And coming into this tournament, we we wanted to like turn the page, and I think we did just that. And I think we just showed that you know we're better than what we what people think we are. From our Sun Power Electric game, Nick Pecorero, 49ers Sack High Sports.